I liked Queen a lot first. That was the first show we saw. I didn't really knew about uh, Brian May that much, you know. Later I found out that his dad built the guitar, which I thought was great. And he played with the coin the whole time, all these little details. <laughs> but we watched, we watched Queen in Brazil, 1981. Our cousin took me and Igor and it from, changed our life from that show. We wanted to do that, you know, that's a good job. We decided that should be a good job for us. Something like that. <laughs> Roger Taylor was really, really cool at the time because it was during the time where people were doing drum solos and, and things like that. I find that was kind of cool, even though I'm not really a big fan of drum solos, but it, that definitely inspired me in the beginning. And in, in my opinion, until this day, like for me, the, the best drummer ever is Bill Ward. You know, he's like very uh, underrated in a, in a certain way, but I think him and uh, John Bohan, they're like right there. Both very uh, open-minded, trying new rhythms and trying new things. But also the way he played, even the way I play with my drumstick inverted on, on the, my right, my left hand, it comes from Bill Ward by listening to him, the way he speaks about drums. And so those are like my main heroes in the beginning.